Hi, this is Margot Burns, the developer of comic o -Matic with Nina Paley's face o -Matic. We've been in beta development for the past month, and I've added a lot of features. We're still in beta, but I thought I'd update the basic instructional video since the interface looks very different from what it did a month ago. Okay, with every version of comic o -Matic, you're automatically given two random characters. In this case, it's the alien and the, the fuzzy rodent. And you can see them down here in their three panels. You're also given six expressions uh, for the two characters across the three panels. If you don't want that particular character, if you say, you know, I really want the kitty instead and the bunny, you can override those changes. And if you say, you know, that, ca that expression doesn't really sum up what I want. Maybe I want a different mouth. You can select the mouth and change it. And then you can say, oh, maybe not these eyes. There we go. I'm going to change a few things around. And now you can add in whatever dialogue you want. So saying, ooh, I'm going to eat you. And this one is thinking, oh, no. And you can have it be thought if you want. It doesn't necessarily have to be talk. It can be thought. So let's just make this comic strip and, and just check it out and see what's happening. So when you click Make This Comic Strip, your comic strip will now appear here at the bottom. So you can see that you know, you've got text here for, for the, the talk and then this thought bubble. You can keep making them until you're, you're happy. So you can just keep adding in various things. Now sometimes you want to have something above the top. So you can say later that same day um, and make the comic strip and you can actually have one line of text up here. You lose a little space for your dialogue, but that's okay. Um, I think setting the scene can be kind of fun. So um, let's see, what are the other features? Oh yes, um, you can't, you don't have a color picker yet, so you can't select your colors. I haven't decided if I want to use up that screen real estate for that, but right now if you uncheck the color, it'll give you a new one when you make the comic strip. So in this case, um, it turns it into, from the, that khaki green into a nice light lavender. If people really think they want the uh, the color picker, let me know um, and I'll add it in. But right now you just uncheck it if it isn't a color you want and it'll make a new one for you. Uh, don't forget to add a title, my comic, and uh, give credit where credit is due. If you wrote it, write in your, write in your name. And um, when you make this comic strip, it ends up coming up here, whatever you put for your title says, there it is, my comic, written by Margot Burns, and art by Nina Paley. Uh, Nina's done all these incredible drawings, and, uh, oh, oh, wait, there's one other really cool thing, because I asked her if she could do this. So, um, let's see, uh, what are some of the things? You can actually put in these little em emoji icons, because everybody knows that uh, comic characters, cartoon characters, don't always just speak in words. So, um, let's see, I'm going to put in, uh, let's see, what are we going to put in storm here? And then I'm going to put in uh, heart here. So if you put those in, in, it'll just replace anything for words and it will put in nice little, um, nice little uh, more drawings. Okay. And uh, once you've got what you want, you can say download my panel. And depending on which browser you've got, it'll allow you to save it. Uh, right now, I don't have permalinks. I mean, you may be thinking that you're going to save the, the comic strip and link to the comic strip from this page. Uh, I wouldn't recommend doing that because as I revise the script, because remember we're still in beta, um, it could change and maybe something that you'd selected before is no longer available. So I recommend that you download the actual images and upload them to whatever social networking sites uh, you want. Uh, come see me on my developer blog, comicomaticdeveloper.wordpress.com. Uh, friend us on Facebook and uh, show me uh, show me what you're making. I really like seeing all the creativity that this nice little web tool is is giving. And uh, um, thank you for all your support and all that use. Thank you.